Hi, my name is Brian Ubenhauer, and I serve as the global leader for source and procurement here at Deloitte. It gives me great pleasure to bring to you the 2018 annual Deloitte Global CPO Survey. This year, our survey was enriched by over 500 procurement leaders from 39 countries with combined revenues of over $5.5 trillion. Simply outstanding. It is because of results like these, we can collectively keep our finger on the pulse of the procurement opportunities and challenges the procurement function is facing today. These include things like market dynamics, value and collaboration, talent and leadership, and digital procurement to name just a few. Global economic growth appears to remain strong in 2018. It's supported by a further decline in unemployment and favorable, albeit volatile, financial markets. This optimistic market outlook presents procurement leaders with an opportunity to deliver an even greater value through growth-focused innovation while continuing to deliver the cost reduction ambitions and managing the enterprise's risk. Key themes that emerged include procurement leaders wrapped up 2017 on a high note, reporting that year-over-year -year savings performed by procurement improved 3%, up from 58% in 2017. In 2018, 78% of the leaders also said that cost reduction continues to be their number one priority, followed by new product and market development at 58% and managing risk at 54%. Despite 73% of procurement leaders reporting that they had the support of their organization's leadership, they still struggle with talent to deliver and progress the digital procurement agenda. High-performing organizations are outperforming others through stronger capabilities in executive advocacy, leadership development, strategic decision making, measurement through balanced scorecards, digital procurement adoption, and supply chain visibility and risk transparency. From a regional perspective, cost is a top priority. In particular, South America. It has seen the largest upswing in savings with 73% of procurement leaders indicating better performance up 30% from last year. The focus on introducing new products and markets has grown significantly in EMEA with 62% responding. However, the level of business partnering has reduced with only 21% indicating that they are excelling. Leaders in Asia Pacific who believe their teams have the necessary skills to deliver on their procurement strategy has improved from 19 to 39%, but this is still the lowest reported across all regions. And then in North America, continued focus on cost reduction and savings performance is being supported by analytics, which is seen by 70% of procurement leaders as the most impactful technology area versus the average of 54%. From an industry point of view, there is a clear correlation between savings performance and business partnering. Most industries have improved their savings performance most notably consumer business, in which 74% of companies performed better than last year, up 13%. However, energy and resources and manufacturing reports that only 50% of companies performed better than last year, well below the average. And only 35% of CPOs in the industry feel very supported by executives. Supply chain transparency reporting varies by industry and is led by financial services in which 41% of companies have good visibility below Tier 1 suppliers. Healthcare and life sciences, on the other hand, reported having less than average transparency, with only 26% having visibility below Tier 1. And in government and public sectors, they are continuing to primarily use digital technologies to enable payment and requisition processing. Conversely, the level of utilization of digital technologies to enable both strategic and transactional processes is quite low in the manufacturing sector. In closing, I want to thank all the participants that supported this year's survey, making it the largest result ever. My colleagues and I hope you find it helpful in fueling your procurement ambitions, strategies, and performance. Please read the full report for more detailed insights and practical actions to help you make an impact that matters. Thank you.